bleeding on the keyboard. A photo going viral after a competitor at the Cincinnati World Piano Competition continued playing on as it was happening. Blood coming from her fingers. That's right, nine on your sides. John Genovese spoke with her tonight and joins us live with more. John. Well, this all happened on Tuesday during her performance. That woman says she has a special condition causing her fingers to bleed, and this isn't the first time it's happened. Her fingers moving with ease, her passion playing through sound. On Tuesday, Rui Uriyama was representing Japan, performing a Bartok Sonata at the Cincinnati World Piano Competition. Has a lot of um, really tough passage work, a lot of vertical kind of piano playing. But after her half hour set, an organizer snapping this photo, the keys on the Steinway and Sun stained red with blood. My keyboard so hard, just studied. It's a site going viral. So far, people viewing this photo online more than a million times. It's just surprising for me. I didn't expect so much reaction. Uriyama tells us she started playing when she was four. She has a special condition in this case, causing her left pinky to bleed. Even it happens in a practice session. It's not the first time it happened to me. I'm like, are, are you okay? She's like, yeah, I'm fine. It happens. Artistic director Awadajan Pratt says it's the first time he'd seen anything like it, forcing them to call in a technician. There was a good 20-minute break or so after after that to, to uh, make it presentable and playable again. It looked like a war zone, you know, the piano, like a battle scene. Uriyama says there wasn't any, but still fellow competitors feeling her pain. We've all had bloody moments um, here and there, but that was very dramatic. Because usually if it happens privately, you stop. Um, but she couldn't stop because she's competing. A pianist truly leaving her mark for the judges. Now get this, Ariyama says she was playing again a matter of hours after that happened. She got to the semifinals, but didn't make it through to the finals tomorrow. Right now she's back in Boston and right now planning for another competition in November. Craig? Uh, 